Hello YouTube. Right now what I'm going to be showing you is um, how to be able to use your iPhone SIM card on your iPad. Those of you who have tried it know that uh, you cannot actually view it at all. If you try to go, you put the SIM card in, it won't let you. It needs cellular, could not activate cellular data network, whatever. Now um, on the top, you can see right there. Uh, I actually have my AT&T iPhone SIM card in there. <clears throat> now, if you, um, in order to show you that it is an actual iPhone SIM card, let me just go ahead and go to settings, turn on Wi-Fi, and then um, just go to your cellular data thingy. And then if you click view account, you'll get this message saying that your your <coughs> your account type does not support the view account feature, whatever. Right? So there's no way you can use it right now. So what you're going to do is you're going to plug in your iPad to your computer. Now this does not require a jailbreak. It does not require for your device to be jailbroken in any way to use it. Now um, you're going to go to the computer. Let's go to my computer. And you're going to go ahead and download this file on the website. I'll have the link for you on the bottom. Um, just go ahead and click download. Your little thing will pop out. Just run or save, whatever. I suggest you save it. And um, that's it for that. Now you can close this out, you can close this out. Now you're gonna go to your iPhone configuration, have it wherever you download it. I have it like right here. Now um I'm gonna have to cover this for a little bit because all my info is gonna be there once it loads up, like right there. So you'll get this window kind of like this. Now you're gonna need to go to your iPhone uh, configuration profile. You'll know you're connected because your your device's name would be here. So you go to configuration profile and then you just click add new. Like right there on the top you just click add new. Then you'll come up to this window. You're going to be basically in general so right there. Uh, just create a profile name like uh, YouTube vid. Right? And identifier, um, you can just put whatever example is there. For me, I'm going to put com dot it's my tech world dot profile. Then uh, organization name, you can just put like whatever sim hack. And then profile description, iPhone sim, whatever it is you want. You don't have to put whatever I did, but you could do whatever. Now on this side, you're going to scroll to the bottom, and then you're going to click on Advance. When you go to Advance, you're going to go ahead and click Configure. And then on Access Point Name, you're going to type in WAP.Singular. That's if you have uh, AT&T. If you have T-Mobile, you know how you can cut the SIM card, whatever. If you had T-Mobile, just go ahead and go online and look for the the settings for T-Mobile. Now, of course you're going to get Edge instead of your 3G and stuff like that, but just give it a, give it a try and if, do a video comment on the bottom letting other people know how it worked for you. Now your username, password, you're going to leave blank. On proxy server and port, you're going to type in wireless dot singular dot com and then your port is going to be 80. Now once you have all that done, just go ahead and go to the side up in the top and click on your device and then you go scroll, go over here where it says configuration profile. Just go ahead and click it and click on the profile that you just made. Uh, I have mine here. It says YouTube vid, whatever, the one I just did. And just go ahead here and click install. Now on your iPad, you're going to get a little window that pops out. You're going to click install, install now, and then just go ahead and click done. 
And just to make sure, just to show you that it actually did save, just go to your general, just to make sure you can double check. Go to your general, then scroll to the bottom where it says um, profile. Let me just go ahead and move this. Right here where it says profile. Click on it, and you're going to have the one that you just made, YouTube vid. That's the one I just did, and it's there. Now, let me just go to my Wi-Fi and turn it off. You don't have to have Wi-Fi on it or anything like that to do it. Just your computer and your iPad. Uh, now, um, you can see right up here, I still have my AT&T 3G. So zoom it in and focus. To have my AT&T 3G. Now, I'm going to go ahead and go to Safari, just so I can show you that it does work. And it's going to do download the page that I just did and there it is it works you can go to several other pages um, just go here and you will be using the 3G network your 3G network from your iPhone SIM card and as you can see it is actually working and that's basically it don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe um, if you tried for the T-Mobile or any other sim, just go ahead and leave a comment for the other people to know. And on the bottom. And that's it. Have a good day.